Hey guys, what's up? Got my new motorcycle lift in and I'm just getting it unpacked. So I'm gonna do a quick time-lapse video of just getting this thing taken care of, set up, etc. It's freaking heavy. <laughs> so it's got label here, heavier end, lighter end, etc. This is where all the hydraulics are gonna be on the unit. Um, but uh, yeah, the delivery guy actually wheeled it all the way up here for me and put it in the garage. It's kind of chilly and rainy outside, so got the garage door closed. Got the heater blasting over there in the corner. So uh, yeah, let's get started. Right, guys here we are at the end um i put the the little bike up on the uh lift just so i could get a, an idea of how stable it is it's very stable i'm shaking it pretty well and it's not moving so um i had to put a two by four this tire is so skinny you know i had to put a two by four in there to, to help brace it up i also am aware that there is a number of upgrades to perform on this and i'll do them at a future date. I do have one problem. <clears throat> they didn't come with the uh, safety bar. I double checked the crate outside. I'm gonna triple check it again. Um, I'm not seeing it, so I'm gonna have to contact the Harbor Freight folks and say, hey, I need this part shipped to me. I've got a breaker bar I can use in lieu of the safety bar, but the safety bar has a detent and it's, it'll stay in there, so. I'm not worried about it, um, but it would give a little peace of mind in case that Jack decided to, uh, well, not do his job anymore, not be a Jack anymore, maybe be a Jill, I don't know. So there's a couple spots there where the safety bar can go, and obviously back here in the back, down there. Um, nope, sorry, that's, I'm wrong. That is not where it goes, it goes here. I don't know what I was thinking, sorry. Temporary lapse. That said, I got to tell you guys, having a bike at this level, um, so my waist, my belly button is right there. So just above that foot peg. Um, and if I'm sitting on my stool, everything will be right in my face. Let's check that out really quick. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is awesome. So you are at my eye level right now. As I'm moving down and up, um, I barely have to, to do any work to get underneath the bike. Oh, this is awesome. I'm stoked. So um, aside from the fact that I am missing one part, uh, I'm very happy so far, you know. Uh, I wouldn't mind having a better wheel lock up here. That stop is fine. On the Buell, I'll be using my uh, um, rear, oh crap, I forget the name of it, pardon me. There's a thing it's called, it's you know, you lift the bike up, the rear, gosh, been a long day, you guys. Anyways, um, it's over there in the corner. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna let this video rip. I'm gonna send you guys the the footage and um, you guys let me know what you think. I'm pretty stoked. This is a big step forward and uh, I can tell you this has been a long time. I should have done this 20 years ago. My back would have been in far better condition than it is now. Um, so this is uh, pretty, pretty awesome. All right, guys, that's it. Um, until next time, peace out and keep it between the ditches. Found it.